What's up? This is Square2448 with FS17 Multiplayer, and today we'll be building a dirt track. What's up, guys? Um, I'm going to be using the case, the red truck. Um, I'm going to be ripping up the dirt. Square is going to fall behind me to comp compact some of it. Um, so let's get started. Yes, this will definitely be a lot of fun. And as we go along through this field here, where there is a lot of trees, we will be buying some lights and some ramps. And uh, this is what the ramp looks like. We will be getting a new one. And this is the light. Looks like a little old, but I kind of like the style for this type of track. So we'll hop in the tractors here. We'll start them up. And he'll be leading the way, ripping up all the grass for us. That's a little tight with the ramp there, but it looks like you made it out. Yep. Alright. So I think we're going to have this be the starting point. So let me... You have to press G. There, there you we go. go. Sorry about that. He's still learning this game? Yep, I'm going to make the starting... Uh, once you do that, I, I will be uh, purchasing some lights, and we will be doing some racing at night, which will definitely be very fun, and the lights automatically turn on once the nighttime comes around, which is very cool. You don't have to manually turn them on, so we'll be putting them all around this, and uh, we might need to clear out some of these trees if they are in the way of the track. But he's making us a very wide starting spot, and we will be racing dirt bikes, ATVs, Polaris vehicles and many more so I guess I will lower this down and start and I will be going behind him and I uh, will just be going through and uh, making this awesome trail here on Gold Crest Valley and if you guys would like us to add anything cool to these tracks let us know down below uh, we should probably put a ramp here alright I will place one and on we'll be leaving way. some of it rough and then some of it smooth. That way it's a different terrain which will be pretty interesting because I know that there's an option to make it so that you can actually uh, have a very uh, tough where the wheels go through the uh, dirt which will be very cool. So these are the lights. They're very helpful and I think that they're going to be awesome improvement on us when we race at night. But uh, we will we'll also be purchasing some trees which I think will be cool. But let's get this ramp. Let's see. We will definitely have to rotate this large ramp. And we will be upgrading the ramp to something even cooler soon. So stay tuned for that. Awesome. So I got the ramp in. And I'm going to come up behind you now. Since I am a little behind. But that's perfectly fine. He's way over there making this track very large. And uh, there are definitely a lot of different turns which will be interesting. So I think once we go up here, we'll drive up it, but I'm not jumping this track. That's not too realistic. So I'll back down it, and look at that. The dirt actually goes a little bit over the ramp, which is fine. And I think we'll leave this whole section over here, just rough dirt, which will be pretty uh hard to get through, which I think will be awesome, though. Changing up the train, we'll lower this back down here, and I'll continue. Wow, this trail is going to have a lot of different types of uh, turns and stuff like that. It's huge. Yes, it definitely will be huge. So stay tuned for part two of this, guys. We might be finishing this and also doing some racing on this, which will definitely be very interesting. This tractor made it up that little hill section pretty good, but I think I'll add some trees in once I purchase some more lights. So let me purchase more lights, and we do need a lot of these, which will definitely help us out seeing at night. And I do like the uh, old style look of these. Looks pretty cool. Just trying to put them throughout this. Alright, I think I'm going to buy a few trees, a few small ones, just to add in. Make it a little bit more like a woods feel. Awesome. Awesome. Trees are growing. Yeah, we did plant a lot of trees, which will also help out with uh, making this feel like it's woods. And let us know in the comments, guys, if you would like us to go through a forest clearing trails. I think that would be pretty cool just to take a forest and go through it, cutting down trees, pushing them out of the way, and continuing. 
Might need your help up here, a little push. Yeah, I'm coming. I'm leaving a lot of this, uh, different types of terrain with the plowed. And then this cultivator really does smooth it out. I'm right behind you, so I'll come help and, uh, put you up that hill. And more power is a lot easier going up something like that hill right there. So, yeah, I'll definitely help out. Hopefully we could get up that with the ATV, though. We should be fine. Alright, are you ready? I do have the weights all the way down, which is very helpful. There we go. Awesome. I think I'm going to put a tree up here once we move. I think that would be pretty cool. Some rocks, too, like, would be cool. Like, yeah, some we'll obstacles. definitely get some placeable rocks. I know that there is some, and they actually have rocks that you can move, so maybe we'll put some in the middle of the uh, track. That way we have to, like, go around them. Alright, I'm going to purchase some more, and we're just going to continue this process. This will definitely be a lot of fun once we uh, get this whoa fully complete. Do you want to add a ramp here? Just this one right here? Yeah, I'll add one. Away. That's a perfect area. I'll rotate it around. Oh yeah, that's, that's going to be actually pretty cool. You go down a small hill and then right onto a ramp. It's going to be very challenging to go through this course, but we might give it a try at the end of today, trying and going through this, since we are almost done with completing the main path, and I believe he is making it so that it's one full circuit track with the finish line and starter at the same spot. Is that correct? Yep. Yep. Uh, you start and finish. We can do lapped races if we'd like. Yeah, it's going to be awesome. So, we don't have too much more here before we get to the start, but as we continue, these trees all around will get larger and larger, which will be uh, awesome, because then we get a large amount of uh, trees. Looks like he's going to do like a loop-de-loop. -loop. Yep. We'll buy some more lights. Always need lights around the track area. Perfect. I think I'm going to just pack in this whole circle roundabout thing oh that looks cool this will definitely be challenging to to race on though a lot of turns but if you guys would like to see more of us building these give us a big like down below and let us know in the comments what we could add to this that would make it even that much cooler and uh, going to be very interesting once we take the ATVs on which we will be doing once we uh, finish this Going in the first person here. Not too much left though. I think he's almost just coming up done. on the end. Yep. I'm just about to finish. That's awesome. We'll go through this. I think I'll actually just leave like a a lot of the last stretch uh, just uh, plowed out. That way it's a lot of harder to get through the finish. And then I will just flatten out over here. And we do have some small, like, buildings here, like sheds, if you would say. And we do have, like, a small, I don't know, facility there to store some tools. But I think that this trail is pretty much complete. It looks very cool. So I think we'll take one lap around this once I have flattened out right here. So if you want to park up and hop in the uh, tracked ATV, I will hop in the regular one once I complete this. Oh, uh, we at the starting line. Okay. We'll just back it up here. We won't put it inside the uh, shed for now since we do want to wash these, but we don't have a pressure washer just yet. All right. Looks like he'll be taking this one. This one is very fast, but I like them both. But uh, let's see which one will do better. Do you want to follow me or do you want to race? No, nah, we could just follow, test it out, and then we'll do a race with a lot of different types of vehicles. Let's try this out. Pretty good uh, width for the track. We can uh, fit the ATV. Try the jump. Wow, that's actually a lot funner than... I did get some air. Whoa, these are pretty hard to handle at high rates of speeds, which is also very interesting and fun. Uh, right here, this turn going up this little hill will definitely be challenging since uh you'll be going at high rates of speeds when we do race pretty dangerous 
Yes, it is, especially with all these trees nearby. We might need to add in some safety, like tires, around the track. I think that would be pretty cool to add. Oh, yeah. They and some rocks. Yeah, the rocks will help out, but the safety tires will make sure that we don't go into trees. So we might do that. I think that would be very cool to do. Look at this, guys. We are going up probably one of the most challenging uh, hills. Oh, it's going up it pretty well. That's awesome. There is a little bush there, so we might need to fix the trail just a little. I do want to get up on our second some speed. Jump. On this, do I get a? I oh oh, oh looks like actually since he just did that, I think we'll call it a day here. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Let us know in the comments what you would like us to do. Thanks for watching and subscribe for more.